Hi, I'm TJ Yoshi here at Marvin headquarters in Warrow, Minnesota. Let's check it out. I spent my high school years here, mostly on the ice, before making it to the NHL. Warroad is known as Hockey Town USA, but that's not all. Marvin, a cedar and lumber company that started here back in 1912, has grown into nearly a $2 billion company, making premier windows and doors you see in businesses, buildings, and homes around the world. I had the opportunity to sit down with a few Marvin leaders to learn more. My guess is if you reflect back, TJ, to your youth coaches, Remember you playing football, basketball, baseball. Many of the Marvin employees were some of your coaches. Yeah, exactly. I tell people about my time in Warroad. You know, you would bike over to your friend's house, go play hockey in the morning, go find someone to take you out on the lake in the afternoon, maybe hit the golf course at some point. So just a fantastic way to grow up and to live life, in my opinion. Whether it's the outdoors and just that way of life, whether it's the wintertime, ice fishing, or being there during the summer, uh, there's something for everyone in World, regardless of season. We get a lot of feedback from people that have come on the second ship, but we can shift as well. The outdoors gives them an opportunity, whether they're hiking or biking or fishing or golfing, uh, a chance to be able to have four days off where they can go through and, and really enjoy the nature that's around World. Sign me up for the weekend shift. <laughs> <laughs> we could use you. Yeah. <laughs> The Lake Town way of life is uh, appealing to so many people. So as you bring in and hire more people at Marvin, how do you deal with the, the housing of the, of the people coming in? We're innovating to try to uh, solve the housing problem. We've got tiny homes going uh, up next to our beautiful community park on the east side of town out here, something different to try to provide housing for those that want to live in a tiny home, something new to experience. We've got apartments going above retail businesses in town that are under development right now. Having moved to World from a larger town, that was one of the concerns that we had of just understanding opportunities for the kids, things to do, extracurriculars, et cetera. And I've been really, really pleasantly surprised with how much opportunity there is for a town the size of World. We've got a thriving school system, coffee shops, breweries, restaurants, and hockey is the hub of our community. We're probably the last place left in Minnesota where hockey is actually free. Kids can skate as long, as much as they want. I drive by that arena, it just amazes me. Six in the morning, 10 at night, and there's cars parked out in front, kids are skating. I lived in War Road back in high school. Uh, I never worked at Marvin, but I have been inside the plant. How has that changed from maybe then until now? As I've watched the company grow, there's just become more opportunities for employees. As we, as we become larger, more technical, more innovative, um, you can start on the plant floor as an hourly worker and you can grow your way all the way to president. I'm proof, I'm proof of that. Growth and development has always been a focus of Marvin. It's not only a job when you come to Marvin, you could make it a career and, and we expand on our strengths uh, to have input across the company based on your interest and where, where you want to go. There's opportunities for you, work hard, self-educate, and the sky's the limit here at Marvin. You can do whatever you want. I'd also say that uh, even within the factory, things have continued to change too. We've got uh, a lot of uh, new things that are happening with air conditioning. We've got updated break rooms that are really helping with that environment side of it. Marvin is a family-owned and family-led company. For someone that has never experienced that, what's so special about it? What allows us the opportunity to do is uh, look at things for the long haul and look at it through a people perspective versus did we make our quarterly earnings? and the long views taken when you're family owned and family led versus uh, a short view. We've never laid off an employee in the existence of the company. It's, that's another thing about family owned and family led um, job stability. Marvin does a great job of, again, feeling like it's a family. The, the company and the employees uh, feel like they're working together. Uh, one of the things I hear all the time from the employees when we talk about our values is it's not just a sign on the wall. It's something that we're living each day. I think that's what helps to maintain our positive culture. Uh, we're at our best when we're working on the needs of others or working on common goals. I think you guys got something very special here. Thanks for remembering where your roots were and coming back and visiting us. It's great to see uh, the company and World thriving together. 